Hi everyone, we are back with another Christmas craft and this time we're going to be doing a snowman made out of a golf ball. And all I've done is I painted it with acrylic paint, a um, couple coats, and you're just going to need um, some acrylic paint in orange and in black. And the orange obviously will be for the nose, but I think I'll do the eyes first. And I'm just going to use the, the flat end of the skewer, dip it in some paint, some black acrylic paint, and I'll do two eyes. And then I will do the mouth. And all I'm doing are very simple dots. And then I'll take the paintbrush and I'm going to paint an orange triangle for a carrot nose. Now you can leave it like that and it looks really cute, but I'm going to take it a little bit further. So we'll let that dry and when we come back we will finish him up. Okay, we are back with the snowman. He's all dry. And all I've gone ahead and done is I took some black felt and I cut a strip of the black felt and glued it into this, this little tube. And that's going to be part of his top hat. If I feed that over the wire, right onto his head. Um, and that might be a little taller than I want, but that's how that will work. And I also cut a circle with a hole in the middle, and that's the other part of his top hat. If I put that down, and then feed the other part over, you'll see how it's coming together. You'll see that's probably, I probably do want it to be a little bit shorter, the top hat. So, I'll just trim a little off. Put it on, see how it looks, and that is much better. So I'm going to first start by gluing the brim of the hat onto his head, and I'll throw a little hot glue right up top, and I'll let that cool. And you can always put some underneath also if you wanted it to like maybe come down a little here or there. Um, you have time to work with that after. So we'll get that on there, put the hat on. And I'm going to put that down here. Okay, feed it down onto there, and there it is. And then I have some thin green ribbon, which I'm going to just trim the hat with. So I'll take a little off after I measure it. So I'm going to put some hot glue around. And there is his hat all trimmed out. Now you could do a scarf, which I'm going to do. I cut um, a length of, of red felt and I'm going to just kind of overlap it like this and see if he fits in there nicely. So then I'll tack it with some hot glue right here. Now let that cool and then I will put some hot glue along the edge here so he can sit right in there. And I'll hold it in place. Now to finish off the scarf, all I'm going to do is I'm going to cut, um, I'm going to kind of fringe the edge of his scarf. Okay, so I have that. And I'll do the same on this end. This is how far we've gotten. And this is a great time to embellish a little bit. Um, you can do it with glitter. I'm going to use some um, shiny sparkly beads that I have. And I'm going to put a blob of hot glue right there on his scarf. And because the scarf is red, I'm going to use some green. Press it in there. And then I'll shake any excess off. And I'm going to do the same on, oops, then I'll collect any of the extra beads and put them back. And then I'm going to do the same on the hat for just a little decorations. And this time I'm going to go with the red. 
Now you can leave him like that. He looks pretty, pretty snazzy and pretty cute. Or you can, or you can use some. I like this slick fabric paint, and I like to put that because sometimes, you know, when I cut around, it's a little bit rough, like around the hat, and I'll just put some snow um, around the edges. And it doesn't have to be everywhere. It's just where, you know, you might want some stuff to be covered up. And then you can throw a little glitter on top of that if you want. I'm going to do an iridescent. Normally I would do more of a white, but I kind of want a different look for this one. This is some pretty fine glitter. It'll be tough to get it out of the hat, but that's okay. I don't mind. And then I might do a little bit on the scarf here and there. Um, on top of the brim of the hat over here. And I'll get the rest of this iridescent glitter off as soon as the paint dries. And I hope you like them. I hope you give them a try. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Happy holidays, happy crafting, and we will see you next time. Thank you.